There's a new surgery technique for patients with bra brain tumors, and Marquette General Hospital is the first to provide it in the U.S. TV6's Jennifer Perez tonight talks with the patient who underwent that surgery. This warning, though, some of the video is a little graphic. Since May of 2011, Jody Ball has been battling three brain tumors. I went to the emergency room because I was having headaches and um, my parents' doctor, my parents' neighbor is a doctor and he suggested that I go and get checked. She underwent surgery, but one of the tumors was too deep. Radiation was the only option until a new surgical procedure called a brain path became available in August. And Marquette General Hospital is the first in the U.S. to offer it. So how does it work? Surgeons start by entering the brain with a four centimeter cut and insert a tube through the natural folds of the brain. Combination of suction and cutting mechanism to remove the tumor and it doesn't generate heat and it's very safe to surrounding tissue. Uh, so it's a real step up from things that we've used in the past. The result is a less invasive procedure. Within minutes, the tumor is removed and the recovery process begins. We're able to take the tube out and the brain beats and beats and beats and the water we displace goes away and it closes in front of you. For Jody, there's no second guessing her decision. And I'm glad I went the route that I did. So, I mean, it, it was not anything like surgery. She's not alone in her fight. Every year, more than 200,000 people battle brain tumors. Doctors hope this new surgery will lower that number. In Marquette, Jennifer Perez, TV6 News.